these junglers being a very important one. And again, if you want to hear from jungle experts specifically about the matchup, switch stream. Smithy lets himself uh, be They're known, going actually. Shot, well, if Huni can even do it, they know that Rek'Sai is around, so do you even want to go for this time? Look how much damage Huni's actually taking, but now Rainover's here. There's a three on two, a nice jump over to a Smithy. He uses Flash to get farther. Nice, a knockup by the Rek'Sai as well, and look at the damage up, but Huni can't chase anymore. Darshan gets away, a good 3v2 defense, but now Huhi is here, and he's level six. Stun's gonna land on a Poe Belter. Can they get all. any more damage? Exhaust is on, there's the Flash out. Pobalter still has heal, a big two-man knock of the flash to chase in for Pobalter. They cannot quite catch Uni. Darshan wants in, and now Afro's, Afro's trying here. to pray as well. That should be a two-man stun. A beautiful play by the CLG support. They won't get quite any more just yet, but Huni's still on the chase. Heal comes through, crossblade across, and Rainover gonna live. No, he's gonna die. A great flash chase by Stixay, and now Pobalter is out of health, and he's out of options. A kill for Darshan. It will trade into the turret, but that is still CLG coming out three to two. Exciting. Rainover's coming. Well, as long as they can track the rest of the champions, they know it's only a two-on-two. -two. He spots out that everyone's there. Darshan now to try to make the outplay. Pops the ult for the stats, and yeah, Rainover can't he fight him. Sun. He's no gonna flash. drop him low, and it's gonna be some help from Aphromoo. Another kill picked up. They bit off more than they can. Not actually available for about 20 more seconds. It's gonna be Smithy joining, though. but here comes the play on Aphromoo. Dangerously low, flash over the wall. There's Rainover on the chase. Bartleby buys a little bit of time, Who, but he is here? certainly going to die for this one. There's the kill picked up. Finds a stun, finds a bit to delay. Stuff Gold is winning the game, you be careful. Okay, got the red buff. Yeah, we'll get to that in a little bit as Darshan fighting 1v2 with the rev up. The fear actually misses from Hooney, and Darshan wins the 1v2, and now to fight right over, He's and go. he will finally be taken down, but look how much effort it requires. Is hurting, and Darshan yep. picks up another kill for himself, and Smithy now. Ooh, Pobelter finding a nice knock back onto Xmithy, who flashes the way, pulls in right over. Stun's gonna land, ulti comes he the ground, the trade of junglers. They both died. Now, can Huni get in onto Pobelter? Looks like the answer is no. A beautiful stun and a wild turtle, perfectly set up by Aphromoo. We caught the end of that one, and top lane turret's gonna go in the jungle, which is kind of one of their advantages because of this pressure. Uh, they're looking for the pick on Adrian. Oh, it's gonna be a lot of damage, and that's gonna be a Karma dropping TP down immediately. In. Teleport coming in for Huni. Does he want to be part the kill? They get the TP down, so Huni Darshan more. will have the advantage, and they're looking for it. Ooh. Turtle's caught. Who he rather goes in and he pre aims the stun. Mad Life's Wild Turtle beautifully. A lot of the good of the plays back and forth. Rain over flashing out the binding. Beautiful stun timed out onto Whoa. the turtle gets caught. Yeah, he was not supposed to be there though by himself. Forced to flash away from this Adrian one from CLG. Trouble, so Winning in cooldown. They've got to be careful because that sun disc goes down. A flash chase for Darshan. Wild Turtle's nowhere to go. And a nice kill picked up by Counter Logic Gaming. 10 to 5 in that regard. And now Enders have TP. Uh, Mortal's kind of slow playing it. They're not sure if this is a bait or what. And this is going down quick. They're going to have to make a move. We'll Ooh, see. Ooh, Bartleby stops too. Will Immortal be able to go in? Right over can. Look for the smite. Still, he's going to get it. Beautiful by Rain over. Counter-Logic Gaming with an easy retreat thanks to Magical Journey. Wave, take out the mid lane turret, and now it's 1,000 up. And now, another play on this side. Huhi forced a flash away, but Huni is on top of him. That's one kill picked up. Xmithy's gonna get away for now, but he's stuck into the turret and slowed down, and the chase is still happening. There's Rek'Sai down to 800 HP. A nice stun on Huni, but he's a really tanky man. Gets a heal from Nidalee, gets a shield as well from his support Karma, and Adrian keeps him alive. Another turret going down. Aphromoo low on health, gets picked off. A nice kill picked up yet again by Immortals. Uh, that's two already. It's all falling apart, and now Huni TPing in. They're gonna get the inhibitor, and they're gonna be pushing for more. They they could actually look to end this with a big mini wave, two wow. down, and just like that, CLGs, they're back against the walls. They need to make a play here. Can they, they, can they hold on? They're going to try, but I don't know if they can. Darshan's just too squishy with this build. He's only supposed to be split pushing. Smithy now stuck under the turret, taking plenty of damage. Guardian Angel picked up. The knockback works on a stick say. And just like that, Immortals are going to cement the they comeback. They have no minions, though. They have no minions. I can don't they know. Hold on? Darshan needs to go in. He needs to look for it. Who he is back alive. Smithy has Guardian Angel. Wild Tour kiting away from Darshan. There's one kill picked up. Who he re back into back. the fight. And they're going to get so much damage. Look at the cleanup right there. Who he's already picked up a couple now for himself. Huni's running away. Adrian's gonna drop his double kill for Rally and Soul, and the Bard chases in. Pobelter now out of mana. Huni running away with rainbows behind him, but CLG want the pot of gold. A nice ult by Huni gets away from the knockup, but Huni still finds a kill onto Pobelter. Sharima is falling. The death timers are 25 seconds long and counter- Go straight for the Nexus. They don't have any time to be bought with these additional Nexus turrets, but Darshan is looking for a flank. He wants to come in from behind. They land the ulti. Can they follow up? Pobelter is caught. Bolt on two. Pobelter stuck. Up, takes plenty of damage because there's not enough follow up though, thanks to his ulti. Darshan gets in the back line, but Azir's turret's trying to keep the Empire alive. A trade of two for one so far, a double for Huhi. The turret still dealing damage to the CLG mid laner. Wild Turtle nearly gets crit down, finally does trade his life back. Three dead on one side, two dead on the other. Nice, a nice Sonya's by Huhi trying to get away now as Rainover is retreating. Counter Logic Gaming have three members alive. Almost invincible if it weren't for that item. 
Looking for the play again. Ray never getting slowed out though. Goes in too hard. And look at the damage he takes in the back line. Back line and OG. separated things to Astro. And here comes the dive. They get past they the Azir wall. They picked up Wild Turtle. Who he putting on the slows. Looking for Poelter. And no one's split pushing the map. It's a triple kill already for CLG's men. They're going to get a fourth. What a beautiful team fight. Raynor were the only one alive to try to save the game. But I don't think he can do it. Raynor's going for the back door. They're pinging it out. He's going to try to make a base race here. Try to make them turn around. Can he do it? No, Darshan. Jax is already based. Uh, he does have the TP available, but Aphromoo, are you kidding me with these plays? I think this is the game right now. It's Darshan like it. slaughtering yeah, Rain over. There's almost no chance right now for Immortals to take this one back. Tourette's inhibitor is already falling. A nice jump over the wall. Chase down. Beautiful by Darshan. The respawns too long. This will be the game one win for Counter Logic Gaming. They were winning the early game. They almost threw it away, but they come back and take a solid game one win over Immortals. Afromu was incredible in the late stages of the game, hitting all